Hey, welcome to the Gospel of Luke. We're at chapter 17, and we're talking about the 10 lepers. We, yesterday, you want to watch yesterday morning, but let's look at the last piece of this today. Two parts. Today's the second part. Verses 15 to 19. So you remember the, lay, this, the way this lays out? Uh, Jesus come, and 10 lepers, they kind of meet together, and they say, please have mercy on us. Jesus says, okay, go do this. And as they're going, it said they were cleansed. Very important lesson. But let's see what happens next, because the the, the main point is still coming. We're going to get it right now. So let's read these verses. And one of them, when he saw that he was healed, returned and with a loud voice glorified God and fell down on his face at his feet, giving him thanks. And he was a Samaritan. So Jesus answered and said, were there not 10 cleansed? But where are the nine? Were there not any found who returned to give glory to God except this foreigner? And he said to him, arise, go your way. Your faith has made you well. So remember, Jesus' audience, a lot of Pharisees and, and Jewish people, they're standing around, and guess what? You know the story. Uh, they have a tremendous, uh, un unspeakable bias against Samaritans and anybody who's not a Jew, basically. So Jesus is going to really uh, shock them here. And so the ten go, and as they're going, they're cleansed. By the way, they're all cleansed. But only one of them, one of the ten, turns around and returns and gives thanks to God. And guess what? That one guy, that's really kind of, the, it's not a joke, but that's the punchline. That's, the, that's the, the reversal. Most of these parables are things that Jesus tells have a big reversal. Here's the big reversal. You think that, well, this guy that's coming back, he's, you know, he's like a, a champion Jewish Bible student. He's a champion Pharisee. But no, the guy that comes back, the one guy that comes back, he's, he's a Samaritan, the, the most hated people. And he comes and he gives thanks and he glorifies God. And that's the lesson here. That's the big point. And he fell down and he gives thanks to Jesus. He, he bows before Jesus. Where are the other nine? Where are the other nine? How many blessings have you and I received from God? But we were like the other nine, the Jewish guys, not Samaritans, but the Jewish guys that needed help. And God, Jesus gave them their healing and away they went. And they, they never looked back once. They, sure, they still got healed. But here's the thing. Notice what it said there. Your faith has made you well. But the key point here is that this foreigner, this is the only one. Many times we are not very thankful to the God who gives us so richly. Let's pray. Father in heaven, thank you for this Samaritan in the story that Jesus tells us. Thank you for someone, someone who's thankful for what you did. Lord, please help us put it in our hearts to have more gratitude toward heaven, to be more thankful to be more recognizing of the blessings you give us. Oh, please, Lord, transform us. Thank you for hearing our prayer. And we ask this in Jesus' name. Amen. All right, friends, this parable is worth your time. Take a look at, at both of the, this whole part that we've studied yesterday and today. And uh, live your life this way. And God's blessings will be upon you.